Oh, hello, and welcome to our very last part in our Let's Try of the American Civil War Revived mod. After this mod, I uh, think we will probably do Calradia Imperial Age. That's a great mod. And it's a lot better now. The current versions of it are far better. Seven Deserters. Why do we keep doing that? 90 in that Confederate army is still too much for us, unfortunately. Farmers. There are those deserters. Oh dear. We are bankrupt. What happened? Oh dear. Sir, I can't say I like to see us not to be able to pay the men. You should treat your men well and they'll repay you with interest. Hopefully it won't happen again. Yeah. Hopefully. Deserters, please. I want to kill you. Thank you. Oh, you'll regret leaving the army. Because you're going to die a gruesome death. What are these trees? God. Our cavalry can just go ahead and charge. Because apparently they are cavalry too. Okay. Infantry, please hold up here. Oh dear. Come here. Come here. Hey. Hey. Don't shoot my little horsey. Eh? You're a very mean man. You deserve to die. This is a cavalry fight. This is the first time we fought an entirely mounted opponent. At least I'm pretty sure they're all mounted. Got you. This is fun, fast paced. This is what we're. This is what our job is. There we go. Cut him down splendidly. Come on, lads. It's only a tad bit of killing. Nothing wrong with it. Good for the digestive system. Our doctor just advanced to level 6. That's good. Please. Please, sir. More death is always welcome. What was that? I think one of our men just attacked our own men. Come on. You do need to die. You're a nuisance. Do you know that, sir? Come on. What? Why does he have a lance? What the hell? Oh! I think he just got shot right in the face. Yay! We lost nobody, that's great. Oh, better horses? 45. No, maneuvers 40, that's not, that's not really better, is it? No, we'll sell them and make some good, good cash off of those. Oh, we made 150. That is very welcome. Washington, D.C. Look at that. We even get to visit Washington in our series. And in the last episode, how fitting. Ah, uh, what were we doing? Market. Quartermaster. I might as well sell them my pistol now. Yeah. There we go. Only 32 bucks from that lot. Not great at all. And a useless amount for those hats. A dollar each? God. No, uh, I want a horsey. There we go, that's where the money is, the horses. I think that was our biggest amount here. We still do not cover the cost of our party, though. Intelligence goes up. Pathfinding even more and spotting. Since that does seem to be our biggest issue right now. Who's here? We got some generals. Oh, look at you. National Color Guard. Fancy. Sergeant. Who? 
Ooh. Oh, oh dear. You're, you're old. Hmm. Know about you? Wife to Brigadier General John Pope. Well, I'm sorry for him. Uh, oh god. There's that woman again. Looks like we got some captured Confederate colors. 15th Alabama Infantry. Washington Wood. General Erasmus Keys. Yes. Do you have any tasks? Deliver a letter to Geronimo? Well, I'm not going all the way back out there, so please send it with someone else, sir. Baltimore? Nobody is here. That's typical for me, isn't it? We can try... Oh, who we got here? Edwin? Major General Edwin von... Edwin Vos... Vos? Vos? Sumner? What type of name is that? Vos? Oh dear. No, he does not want my help. Well, you're a silly bugger. Where did that army go that we were following? There it is. Philadelphia. Splendid, indeed. Tasks? Ah, you probably know that I'm the military governor of the town of Dubois. However, it's been months since many of the citizens of Dubois paid the taxes. Much less on time. Apparently, townsfolk have grown unruly lately. I need someone to go there, remind them we're at war, and they have an obligation and duty as citizens to pay taxes. Persuade them if they won't listen to reason. If you go and collect, I'll give you one-fifth of everything. Fantastic offer, yes. The citizens are not stupid, so do be careful. Well, I beg to differ. Dubois. There's Dubois. This is a good one to get us money. Which we desperately need at the moment. Hopefully we'll find some people along the road we can kill. No. Oh well. Collect the taxes. Yes, yes, yes. They're silly. Silly little squids. Ignore them and continue collection. We do need the money. I'm afraid. There goes somebody passing by. I love the sound of that. Ching, ching, ching. Ah. Uh, wow, with 3,164 tax dollars. Can I get a refund on my taxes? Where is he? Because he was up near Philadelphia last time we saw him. Now the fun part of trying to find the guy. Okay. Notes. General Park. Yeah, two days old, the report that he was near Philadelphia. I doubt he's here now. New General Park. No, that's Meade. Let's talk to Meade. General Meade. Top squid. I wish to ask you. Where is Park? Hartford? Why would anyone go to Hartford? Oh dear. That is a distance away, isn't it? Just my luck. Hey, 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 hey. Burnside. Who else was that? Not the guy we need. Continue. Ricketts. Maybe Ricketts will have an updated report. Yes. I wish to ask you where General Park is. Oh god, he's he should be close to Portsmouth. He's traveling to Washington. Portsmouth. Okay. He's traveling to Washington, so we should come across him on the road here. I'd hope. Yes. Take your taxes, you, you silly man. Here's all the taxes. Ooh, yeah. He gave us 2,531. You, sir, have just fixed my problem. Although we didn't... 
Only 954. Hmm. Let's upgrade our doctor. Put you in strength. And as your doctor, we're going to put your skills into wound treatment. That seems right. And it's only sensible you have one-handed skill upgrade. Let us... Did we go into Philadelphia? I don't think we went in there. Let's, let's go in there. Maybe there's a general we can get something from. Forest bandits. Haven't seen these in a long time. Yes. Yeah, I'll take on both of you. It's an even battle. They got 30. Everybody follow my orders. Let's put our infantry up on here. Do spread out a tad, will you? Fire at will, please. Cavalry on me. Spread out a tad. Yeah, they've got a lot. Let's try and flank them. Do them in the rear, boys. Fire at will and charge. Jolly good. We'll destroy these banded ditties. You, sir, are a silly little ditty. Come to me. Don't shoot my horsey. Pablo doesn't like that. Come on. Come on. Th we've demoralized them. They're attempting to surrender. But, as we know, our regiment doesn't take prisoners. He just died in front of me. That's fun. Before you get a chance to reload, thank you for uh, playing the game, sir. Come on. Come on. Come on. Your life is not necessary, and you are going to die now. Fuck. He had a time, didn't he? Where are the rest of these squids? Little buggers trying to run away across the river. How dare you? These are the types of fights we like. <laughs> I think he got shot. Come on, come on, come on. I can get you. No! He ran off the map just in time, that stupid man. We lost nobody, that's great. We got some Union uniforms that we can give to our companions. We'll sell all this stuff. Splendid. There's that guy that ran away. Okay. Not sure what happened there. Go to New York City. Sell the stuff first. Let's go to you. Show me your equipment. I will give you the rough infantry uniform. You don't want that Confederate hat now, do you? Take the old Union Kepi. Hmm. It appears you need shoes. Well, you just have to suffer with the glitchy boots for now, my friend. Oh well. Who else? The doctor. I don't. I don't the doctor should have a uniform. Let's talk to Sarah Sealy. You're a weird-looking squid. 
and we'll give you the blanket. Oh, that looks weird. No. But it's the best armor one, so we'll go with that. Heh. <laughs> Cheap black hat. No. There we go. What are these boots? Dear. Well, it's a bit glitchy since they need shoes, but we won't bother. Who else needs the uniform? The doctor doesn't. So, now they're done with that, we'll go ahead and sell the rest of this stuff. The regiment's nothing to eat. Well, we'll fix that in a moment. Taylor. Sell off. These useless clothes for apparently a dirt cheap price. That's unfortunate. And then we got all these weapons. Rather useless muskets. Since they're so cheap. The cartridges give us more money. General store. Sack of corn. Right, we'll go for the bread. The bread and the grain. What should we do next? Let's try and find more of those. There. Group of 12 forest bandits. This is getting much easier now that we can actually move around the map speedy like. Oh dear. Our infantry hold here. Our archers, too. Do spread out, both of you. Our cavalry can come with me. Okay, fire at will. Fire at will. Ah, no, 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 no. Cavalry, follow me. That's what I want to do. Come down here. Fire at will. Charge. The Pinkerton agent has been killed. That's a. Oh. Oh dear. Unfortunate. Volunteer infantry is killed. I don't mind so much if our infantry are killed. It's the. these horsemen we want to live. They're rather pricey. And they are our most upgraded. I think it's just this guy running away, yeah. Scum. Hmm. I think that's the most men we've lost. Oh, we got shoes. We can give someone shoes. That's the only thing we need to keep. $96. Mr. Cabot, yes. Equipment, please. I give you shoes, sir. Done. And I should stay back to New York and we'll sell off that stuff. The market. Quartermaster. Take this trash. Taylor, yeah. Sell off the uniforms. Well, it's not a big amount of money now, is it? Mounted infantry. Zwav. Should we go for Zwavs? Those are fun. Yeah. Let's get Zwavs. Zwavs are very fun. Right. That's not what we need to do. We're going to run out of money. Let's try and find more things to kill. Like you. Forest bandits. There's a plenty ton up here. This is good. Why is it now that we're at the... V I've marked the last episode of the series. We're gonna find all the enemies. Where's that coming from? 
Where is he? Oh, up there. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Our infantry hold. Our archers hold. Keep our cavalry down here. Don't want them to die. We can make these people fire now. Follow me, cavalry. Spread out, if you please. I'll try to lose as few of as possible. Fire well. Then we'll take them from the side. Before our infantry become too useless to deal with them. Good. I'd rather take a hit to my horse than lose one of my troops. Die. Save our infantry here. We literally saved our infantry. Come on. Don't run away like a like a sissy boy. Better to die on the field. It's the doctor's treatment. Come here, come here. You're no good to us. Oh, here's our Zwav. See him. Very nice. We didn't lose anyone, that's great. And we caught a prisoner. Yay. We need that. And there's shoes. We must take the shoes. Advanced to level 9. Do our agility. And... Inventory management. Again, increase our one-handed so we are even better with our saber. Let's give you your shoes. There you go. Very sorry I'll had to wait for them. Bit of a shortage in supplies these days, you know. Look at all the bandits. Oh, yes, so many bandits. And I'm afraid we're coming to the end of our episode. We're going to need the market. Quartermaster. Sell these. Muskets aren't necessary. And the tailor. Do take this. Thank you. How are we for the food? We're doing great on that. So, in order to finish off this series, I think we should go down to Washington. As we're a Union regiment. Go down there. We. Baltimore. Where's the Union going? Oh dear. Right, then we'll take a walk around Washington, D.C., shall we? To end it off. For a walk around the streets. I think we've earned the right to walk around Washington. Oh, oh dear. Washington is not quite a city. Who are you? Union Veteran Regular. Mind your manners and we'll have no trouble. How dare you? I am an officer. Tap you. You squid. Absolute squid. Tell me to mind my manners. Do you know who I am? I am Lieutenant Silverstone. Oh, you no 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 no. I will speak. Oh, uh, it's McClellan. What a perfect way to end it off. Major General George B. McClellan. Looks like the guy too. Do I know you? My name is Lieutenant Silverstone at your service, sir. 
I'm Major General McClellan, Commanding General of the Army of the Potomac, the Military Governor of Washington, D.C. I see that your regiment carries colors, though I don't recognize them. I'm always looking for good men to fight with us as they prove themselves. Ooh. General, I have come to request promotion to the rank befitting of a senior officer. You've yet to show yourself as a competent commander, Lieutenant Silverstone. Get some more experience leading men in combat, and prove that you're worthy of another promotion to a higher rank in this army. Then we'll speak more of that matter. Do you have any tasks? Ah. Yes, there's something you can do for us. We've heard reports that a group of Union deserters have established a hideout in the area, and have been attacking travelers. If you could find their lair and destroy it, we'd be very grateful. Outlaws such as these will usually establish a base in the highlands, often on a steep ledge where they have a view of the surrounding countryside. This makes them difficult to surprise. The best way to discover this location would be to find a group of mountain bandits who appear to be heading back to their base and resupply and follow them. Aye, I'll do it. Very good. We will await your word of success. So we'll finish off our series here with our very last mission. Serving the commander of the Army of the Potomac. Lake Fion. What's this supposed to be? Another training place, I presume. Yes, we're gonna have to find where those mountain bandits are. And I believe it's what they're talking about up here, where there's so many. And we'll just have to follow them. There's a battle. Farmers and deserters. Well, I'll, I'll aid the farmers. That'll increase our relation. Everybody charge. I think there's only three of them. On, boys. Scrub the earth of these peasants. These worthless thieves. Whoremongers. Thank you. That has ended you. Is there more? Who else is there? Over here. Ah, there. You. You, sir. Die. Thank you. That was a great success. Thank you for your help, sir. You saved our lives. Yes, that's what I like to hear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Now we can continue on. Try and find that hideout. As I die here, I'm going to sip. Yeah, here we go. All the bandits. There it is, the forest bandit camp. Before we go ahead and do it, I think we should upgrade our men. Probably the infantry. Some zwabs. Don't need to worry about the money. Stagecoach guard. Mounted infantry. And then we'll go ahead and upgrade Sarah here. Skills, strength, iron flesh, one-handed. And we shall go into battle and destroy the camp. You approach the hideout. The Union foragers don't appear to have spotted you yet. You can still sneak away unnoticed. The difficult approach to the site through a pine swamp it means only a handful of troops in your party will be able to join the attack. They will be unable to bring the horses. If your initial attack fails, the Union forgers will easily be able to make their escape and disperse. Do you wish to attack? Attack. Very good. Charge, men. It is only a handful, isn't it? Oh god, you're gonna have troubles, aren't you? 
with our pathfinding again. This is the issue with this mod. Who is shooting? How dare you? Where? What are you firing at? I must be stupid. After this battle, I think our men need a big bowl of mac and cheese. That seems very union. I don't know why. It just does. Come up here, please, people. Ah. I do see you now. Unfortunately, I couldn't hit you. Charge, since most of you men only have pistols. You're going to be rather incompetent at this range. This is a nice way to end off the series. Much better than the way we had to end off the uh, Victorian era. Thus we get a final mission. To destroy this apparently very big deserter chain at their hideout. Do allow me to shoot you. No? Not in the mood to die today? Well, I have other plans for you. Where are the rest of them? The rest of them are way over there. Oh, he's coming around. He's gonna come around and shoot me. Please don't shoot me. Hello. That was terrible. I moved my mouse a bit too much there. Come on, it should be pretty easy for you fellows to defeat these guys. You are the Silverstone Cavalry. None can compare. That is our regimental motto. Which will be our regimental march. Hmm. I think our regimental march will probably be, uh... Oh dear. Probably Gary Owen. Like the 7th Cavalry. Ah! Shot you in the back. It's the only way you deserve to die, deserter. Confederates? What? What do you got confederates at a Union deserter camp? Oh. Oh, I see you. Please don't shoot me. Oh, that was close. Come on. Oh, what happened? I was not expecting that to shoot because it was apparently still loading. Oh dear. We're not doing so well, are we? Uh, where's the last bugger? They're over here. Come on, Jeremiah. You saucy squid. Die. Yay! Cut above the wrist. There's a couple more over there. We gotta reload our rifle. Oh dear. He died. Thankfully, it was one of theirs. So was that. Oh, we're successful. With their retreat cut off, the Union foragers fall one by one to a determined attack, and some of their Confederate friends. Their hideout and ill-gotten gains, now yours. Oil. And linen. Oh, I, d I do think this is a very successful final episode. Best way to end it off. Making the big bucks. Just look at all this Confederate stuff. And that's all we can take. Save. Splendid. And then we'll go back to Washington. to tell the commander-in-chief of the forces and sell our stuff as well. Boy, we're fast, aren't we?
This is great. They weren't this fast in the Victorian one. Here we go. Washington. The market. Quartermaster. Take these weapons and cartridges. 85 bucks on that. The tailor. You can take all these gaudy Confederate hats, please. And their silly little uniforms. Oh, well, I'll sell it here. Look at that, $780. That's our big bucks. There's McClellan. We meet again, Lieutenant Silverstone. Well, about that task. Yes, have you made progress? Still working, what? You mean that wasn't them? I'm pretty sure. That's the only one. I didn't see any forest bandits in this area. Are they in the hills over here then? Well, we're gonna have to, uh... Find some more bandits and follow them. They are mountain bandits. Yeah, there's a lot. Ah, oh, there we are. I think it must be these. Pretty sure. Follow me. Try and come down here. Yeah, they're in a, a little crevice, indeed. Oh, that wasn't nice. Where are they? They're over here. I shot him. Apparently someone shot us too, but it, it didn't kill us. Probably stand sideways while we're loading this. I hope this makes us successful. Either way, we killed the other the other hideout, so I think that's worthy of mention too. What? They all just stand right here and then they spawned in. It's unfortunate. I killed you. Till you're dead. That's worse. Oh boy. It's not going well. Well, I mean it is, but it never goes well when we lose someone. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Please die. And you? Another one? Oh! Oh, we just got shot in the face. Damn it. And I didn't save it, did I? Hold on. Okay, so I... The last save point I had is when we had just beat back that previous bandit lair. And we're gonna try this again. We need to finish this series with this successful quest. Attack them. But they do seem to be a bit tricky. So hold your fire until we get in the range. I mean, we're certainly in range, but not... Not effective range, anyway. Here. Fire now. No. No those squids. No oh dear. I wish we could nail. That'd be much more convenient. 
This would probably have been a good one to keep my revolver for. You shot him? No, 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 no. We have learned that we need to destroy these as soon as they spawn. Because more will spawn in here. And we're just gonna camp them. Wait until they spawn in. Because there was someone over here that shot me in that last one. And it wasn't nice. I will just hide in this tree. Yep, there we go. He has spawned. I stab you, sir. Our little friend Philip is doing pretty good here. Any more gonna spawn here? Let's hope not. I th I think we've yeah we've gotten to their last defense. We won. With retreat cut off, we win. Dies? Oh yes. Oh yes, I do like that. Those dies will be worth some money in Washington, won't they? Take this stuff. There we go. Now we've been successful. We can go to McClellan to claim the reward. I presume he'll probably be in the Washington area. I can only hope he will. That was good. It was a good way to finish off this series. Considering we had some troubles. Let's pick it. What? Mark it. Oh no. We can sell the worthless stuff. And then we'll see how much we get for the dyes after. Yeah. There's that fresh chicken. It'll probably go bad. Oh, forgot that. Okay, let's see how much we got for the dyes. 178, oh yes. That is what I like. Headquarters. No. Anybody home? No. It's a shame. Hello, Jeremiah. I want to know the location of General McClellan. He should be Sharpsburg. Oh. Sharpsburg. Sharpsburg. Maybe through the fort? Oh, dear. That must be it. Yeah. A battle. Oop. Confederates only have nine men left. Well, we won that. Oops. That's General Park. There's McClellan. We meet again, Lieutenant Silverstone, and splendid work. Your audacious attack is the talk of the nation. No doubt they or others like them will soon be back. But for a short while, you have bought this land a small respite. We are most grateful to you. Mm. Thank you, sir. Of course, Lieutenant Silverstone, farewell. Let's ride our regiment back to Washington. And then... We will say farewell, and thank you for joining us on our American Civil War adventure here with the revived mod. It's obviously rough around the edges in many places, but this series has managed to highlight what the playability of this mod is like. And we will go ahead, and I will uh, meet you again in Calradia Imperial Age. Tally-ho! Mm -hmm.